go. So everyone, I'm still up here in the uh, Loggia de Lanzi, but I've changed your direction away from the Town Hall Square. We're now uh, looking uh, towards the Uffizi. In fact, can you see that this is the side of the Town Hall that then when Cosmo I moved in here with his family, his wife and his little illegitimate daughter, uh, Bia, um, and converted this into the first Ducal Palace, he then almost immediately started to work on a magnificent, huge, monumental, new administrative block, which we call the Uffizi, and then connected the town hall, his now Ducal Palace, to the administrative block where he brought in all of the guilds. He made sure that the headquarters of all the guilds were in this block, and he connected it with this fabulous passageway so that he could very easily and quickly walk from his Ducal Palace to check up on what everybody's doing. And then um, the Uffizi is absolutely massive uh, and it still retained its administrative function um, throughout the centuries. However, on the top floor, his son Francesco I uh, decides to uh, convert that into the place where he's going to keep his precious object collection and that's how we get the idea today that the Uffizi equals an art collection exclusively whereas in fact it was uh, a bit of everything going on here which is kind of interesting.